on. How's it going? My name is Dan Kinegi. This is Max Doggett. We're from Wolfhound Martial Arts Academy. And uh, today we're going to be talking about some escapes and reversals from the side chancery or the side headlock. Okay. Um, if I have a proper side headlock on Max here, okay, his head is going to be twisted. His, like I said, his pectoral, his, his chin should be resting on my pec. Okay. Hips square, giving him twist in his body, bring his head down to his waist level, taking away all of his leverage, okay, and taking away a lot of his strength. My blade of my forearm is going to be coming right across his, his mandible, okay, right there for a face lock, okay. This is one of those moves that everybody, oh, if I'm in that headlock, I'll just pick him off and throw him backwards. It's not as easy as most people think. Okay. I can't hold him here for a long time. Not to mention, every time he goes to pick me up, I'm cranking a face lock. I'm going to have fists coming down, punch him in the face. It's going to be very disorienting, very distracting, very painful. It's not as easy to just pick somebody up and throw them as you may think. Okay, with that being said, if you're caught in this hole, you're not stuck here. There are ways to get out. Okay, so with this being bare knuckle boxing, like I said, the first thing that's going to be happening is I'm going to be striking into his face. As my fist is coming in here, striking him, he needs to secure that, stop that. Okay, once he secures that fist, his other hand is going to come across my near side shoulder. He's going to take one of his fingers underneath the bridge of my nose. He's going to push up and back under the bridge of my nose as he stands up. Simple. It really is simple. The leverage that you get underneath the bridge of the nose to force them back is, is amazing. Okay. So from here, when you go to secure the fist, come across and throw me straight back. Okay. That's a very easy, simple one. The other one, another escape. Well, this one's actually reversal. From the headlock, again, he's going to secure the fist from punching him in the face. His other arm isn't going to come across my near side shoulder, it's going to come across my far side shoulder. He's going to interlock his hands and a basic grip, and he's going to, as he brings his hands down and across, he's going to step his rear leg in front of mine. There you go, reversing. Okay? It's actually very simple. Again, I have him here, I'm striking. Boom. And there it is. He breaks my grip, puts me into a precarious situation. And from that point, he can then take me down or start to strike at me. It's a very simple, very easy thing. The key is to before he gets full strikes in, and before he can come with a face lock onto you, okay, or before his takedown, you need to secure that fist, okay, and you reverse it. So it's very, very simple right there. We have chancery, side chancery, and an escape and a reversal from the chancery.